So my experience with the Benuo portable space heater has been mostly good. There's only a couple things that I kind of wish uh, that they would have changed on here. They're not deal breakers, just some things that I, you know, would kind of like to see a change. For the most part, this thing puts out a lot of heat. If you have it on a table, kind of like this, facing you to keep you warm, it does shoot the air upward. So at this distance, um, you could probably sit about four feet away and still, you know, feel a nice bit of heat coming from it. If you put it on the floor, you can be a little further away, probably say about five feet, because then, you know, like I said, the air uh, shoots more upward. So really anything below here, you're not going to feel more, you know, up like it is on the table. You're going to feel the heat. It's got three different modes. It has, you know, the highest heat, mid heat, and then no heat, which is basically to cool you off. Works really well. It also has an oscillation feature where it moves side to side. So here I'll turn it on. The, the, the first gripe I kind of have about this is that it does not remember your last setting. So as soon as you turn it on, it goes to full heat. So if you, you know, you're using it as a, a cooling fan, it goes right to heat. And every time you turn it on, you have to, you know, hit the mode to make it go back. So that's, that's the first thing. So I'll turn it on here. It's got a little uh, glow back here to kind of show you what heat mode it's on. Hit the mode again. It turns, you know, dimmer and then hit it again and then it turns blue to let you know that it's in cooling mode. And you hit the swing and it oscillates, which is pretty nice. And it's fairly quiet too. It's not obnoxious at all. Um, for the most part, it is fairly quiet turn it off and then it just goes into kind of like a little cool down mode. It continues to push air through to kind of cool everything off before it totally shuts off. So there's one thing to keep in mind. Uh, as you can see, it is plugged in. If you are planning on using this on carpet, the little safety switch underneath it on mine goes right into the carpet and does not depress so it will not turn on. So that's one thing to keep in mind. This is really meant to be used on a hard surface like a hardwood or like a countertop. And just to show you it is working, here's a little safety switch. I'll push it in and turn it on. And release. So that's just one thing to keep in mind if you are you know, if you needed to use this on your carpeted floor, just be aware that it most likely will not work. On the back here, it's got a removable air filter. Just kind of pull this up. And then here, you you know, it's, it's like a like little thin piece of filtering. So you just put that on there and then put that back. And then it has a, a physical on-off switch here too. It's been working great, uh, like I said uh, before, it puts out a lot of heat. So if you're looking for a nice, small, quiet, compact space heater, uh, this is one that I would definitely recommend you take a look at. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video and you took something away from it and hopefully answered some questions that you might have had about the product. Hope you guys have a great day.